Yo, 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 people, and welcome back to another edition of Three Men and a Vape Show. We have got a special guest on tonight. He is from another northern, northerner, if you can say it properly. Northerner. Northerner. It's Benny Vapes, people. We've got him on. Nice and live. We will be sticking his link all the way through. Make sure you go down and subscribe. Simon. Yes. How are you, brother? Um, very well, thank you. It's not like you turn up after another week afterwards, or... <laughs> Oh, says he. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's not normal. That you, it's like two shows in a in, in a month. What's happening, bro? Uh, it's because you've been. <laughs> it's because you've been here to host the show oh, for I a see. change. Oh, I see, see. <laughs> the one and only Salford's now got rid of the shits, the spews. He's a happy man, aren't you, bro? I've still got a cold. But he is. He is a happy but, man. But, but, let me just apologise to everybody last week that I thought I was just being a, my normal, miserable old bastard self. I wasn't. I was actually ill. <laughs> he was poorly. He was a poorly mister. We, we know you're a poorly mister. You could tell. You could tell you were not... Sorry, I'm trying to turn you up on the wrong fucking screen. <laughs> was that doing it? When I was actually sort of sliding off everywhere? <laughs> Dude, you're a lot better now. That's the biggest thing. Yeah. Benny Vapes, it is so nice to see you, brother. How are you? All right, not too bad. Rushing around, <coughs> got late on from work and then had to come on here, so... Yeah. You didn't have to come on, obviously. Oh, no, do you need to know what I mean? I, I did, you forced me out. You said, come on. Come on. <laughs> we, in we, did, we, did twist, we did twist your arm, but no, it's so nice to have you, brother. <laughs> no, it is. Thank you for having me on. If you don't know Benny Vapes, he is a brand new reviewer. I think you've been doing it, what, roughly about six months? Yeah, I think I started just before... Expo last May, just before then. Um, so what's that? Five months, six months. So yeah. If I haven't got your actual link, but um, if anybody, uh, one of our uh, wonderful um, spanners, if you can get down there and get his link and, and spam it out for us, we'd like to get him to get a few more subscribers. Have I? Have I, un I, I think I've just undone everybody there. Is that right? Was we a little bit uh, muted by then? Are we on? I don't know. Has anybody said that? What? Are we muted? Not in chat. Was we muted? <laughs> it doesn't matter anyway. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are back with another edition of Little... I would say Little Bro Vapes, then. It's not Little Bro <laughs> That's it. That's how bad it's going to be tonight. Empire, Empire building, I Empire. I say, yeah, we keep building it all up. Well, we'll go straight over to the wonderful uh, Salford. What are you actually vaping on today? Well, I've got the double barrel out that I did the review for. I was out yesterday um, with the dead rabbit on top, and in that I've got uh, dinner ladies lemon tart, and I've got my usual. I've got the deck kit with these light tank with my own tobacco in, and you're only allowing me to, so I'm going to shut up now. <laughs> no, I didn't mean like a top and a bottom. You can do two. Gaily Box, thank you so much for putting Benny's in there as well. Please go over and subscribe to him. And it finally arrived. Me Vinci finally arrived. I only ordered it last week for next day delivery. Um, so can you tell me how the airflow works on that, please? Flip it back. Uh, oh, <laughs> I tell you what, I tell you what, even with the mouth to lung part, it's still too open. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know, I watched the show back, yes, uh, I think the other day I watched the show back, and that was just so funny. I've been showing it for two weeks, and I, like, I know you did, I know you did. They got right bitchy on, didn't they? Hmm? Right bitchy on. Proper fucking tits on there, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I've been showing it, Aiden. Do you not listen? I, I'm not going to say anything. <laughs> <laughs> so is that your two? That, that's all. That's all you're allowing me. Otherwise, I'll be, we'll be here all night. Go on, go for another one. You can, you can do a couple more. All right. Okay. I've got the uh, sub home, uh clone. Well, it's the X home clone, the sub home out with the Rico jewel on. And I that's do got, like that picture as well. That's quite a nice, cutie picture. It is. It is. Uh, and I've got Rickers Boulevard in this. Who is it? Boulevard. Really good. Here's a picture of Salford. It's, Salford. Uh, it's me, ex Mrs. <laughs> uh, <right. laughs> no, it's just. Literally, is why I left her is because you were more wicked than licked. Uh, <laughs> yeah. And I've got other pod systems about like this and what have you. Uh, he wants to look at the picture of the mod. 
Right. Pitch it on the mod. There you go. Can't see it. <laughs> your ex-wife. Uh, I wish. In your dreams, yeah. <laughs> that's me. That's me, basically. I'm not going to go on to that. And whatever. So, so, we'll go straight to our guest. Benny Vapes, what are you vaping on, brother? Hey, up. Well, I'm on the Tinker 2 with the intake jewel. And in that, I've got some Hip Hop Juices Africa. And I've got the new, because you've got this, haven't you, Eddie? The Blitz Enterprise yeah, Realm. Yeah, it's quite nice. Yeah, been trying that out. It's not bad. And in that, I've got some Black Vine. Alright. Got a bit of a, a Jay's. What do you th have you tried it? What do you think of it? I think it's really good. I'll tell you one of the biggest things I like about it is um, the filling port. It's quite wide, uh, which mm -hmm. a lot of these devices, they have little small filling ports. So you're not really getting um, an air lock in it. The other thing I like about it is that the fact is, you know like when you used to have a, like an old Escort or something like that car? And yeah, you, 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 you're about older. <laughs> I'm glad I you, cla you clarified yeah. that was a car, yeah. It was a car. Yeah. So, you know, you used to get out, down to your petrol bit, you know, when it used to just sit down on the end, but you could go for another 30, yeah, 40 mile. On. That's the battery on this. It goes right yeah. down, and it's like, you just carry on for quite a while. Yeah, yeah, no, it's, it's a nice bit of kit. Only thing I don't like is airflow's a bit, a bit janky on it, but you won't like it, Simon, because it... Oh, that would drive me nuts. It rattles. It does, me. yeah. Absolutely the the battery door is actually rattling. Yeah, what rattles. thing do you like on the airflow? I, I don't think it's that well, bad of airflow. Try and put your finger, if you put your finger over there, you can't, it gets really tight. <laughs> yeah, but it's, it's, not, it's there it's, for a direct to lung, it's not there for a mouth to lung, it's there for yeah, a direct to lung. It's still, there's no, that's that's the only bit that's taking it in, it's through there. There's no else to take the air in. comes out, you take, it, take that off and it's a lot better. Yeah. It's just that I find I don't, that, I don't mind it for a direct finger over it. Well, it's, it's alright, it's nice, I won't say, it's, I'm not going to say it's crap, right? Um, better than PAL 2. I don't mind the PAL 2 either, but yeah, let's go. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> See, that's the great thing about reviewers. Each person has a different sort of feel on things, and, and th th that's the whole point of being a reviewer. It rattles like mad, does this. I can't. Uh, honestly. It, when you put it on, it just. Is that. If you get. If you get. If you get the one, yeah, but I, I have two, so I have one with like the coloured door on it, like the, the was it some glass into it, tempered glass or something. That slides up and down on the pal too. The one yeah. that isn't tempered glass, just a plain ordinary one, doesn't move at all. Right, yeah, yeah this is move, doesn't bro. shift. The old one with little thing on that. No, I'm not. It's all right. It was like a lot of people had the um, uh, from Sigeli, the Snow Wolf, um, the A thing. And, and they all say that the, the batch of draw, mine doesn't move. So I think you right. get so many different versions of it. I think it's because they mass produce them, don't they? You yeah. know what I mean? So, QC's not brilliant from China, is it? Yeah, we all know that. <laughs> so what else are we on, bro? I've, I've just said, I'm going to do, man. It's all done. Yeah, well, I'm not sure. I've got, I've got my daily vape that I was just showing you earlier on, which is the Sense Orbit TF. With Maccas, oh, I thought, yeah, wonderful bloke as well. One of my best friends in the world. All day, um, that. Bull Mac Mac is that How much is that? What you've got there? Because you you were saying a bit, it's a bit plastic -y, fantastically, but, yeah, it's, a bit, but... it's about eighteen quid. It's just plastic. You take, if you, I dropped it and these panels pop off, and it's just got a battery inside like but it push just clicks back on. It's just clicked on plastic, but. I use this for work. It's in my pocket, and if I smash Money, it, mate. then I'm not bothered. Well, uh, so you got to worry about, isn't it? If you, you're having something like an all-day banger for work, yeah, and you yeah. drop it, you don't worry about losing it. So, right, yeah. straight over to the wonderful Simon. No, Ooh. let's let's just fucking change it up for once because you're always last. <laughs> so let's do you next. Okay, we'll do me next. Um, I've actually got a bomb. Wait, no, it's a semi semi mechanical. Let's let's make it. In your hands, it's still a bomb. It's still a fucking bomb to me, I'm telling you now. Can you imagine what my brother's saying now? Uh, we've actually had uh, 20 norks. I don't even know what a nork is. Does anybody know what a nork is? <laughs> I know Norwegian. what a nork is. <laughs> Norwegian something or other. Norwegian kroner, is it? That's it, yeah. We've, we've actually... Well done. 
Red Pep Net, thank you so much. So we'll have to remember um, that question for when we finish this. What is your favourite mech and RDA for 2016? We'll get on to that in a second. 2019? Two th- yeah, sorry, did I say 2018? No, you said 2016. 16. He's a lot younger. <laughs> I always live in the past, that's true of me. See, I've turned the fucker off now. It's, it's obviously not a proper mech. It's a foosh. Here we go. We end up pressing it loads of times. It's a foosh. It's a foosh. Is that what you take to work with you? You stay at light. Yeah, it's that down there at the top. <laughs> yeah. Good flavour with the Alexander on that. And I've got some of the um, crew juice, which we got from... Uh, there was with the Blitz stand. Quite nice. That's um, It's supposed to be an ice cream, but it just tastes like orange to me. It's like a more like a liqueur. Liqueur. Well, that's my nickname, you know. Liqueur. No, Drambuie. Oh. Oh. It's got Why? some fancy liquor. <laughs> did it, did it. We're here all week, do try the fish. Uh, we've got the uh, Hubble, which I'm calling it the Hubble, which is from Vaptio. If you don't screw, the, if you screw the tank all the way down, you have to leave that little gap. If not, it tells you that it's actually shorting. Excellent. <laughs> Flavour's not bad, though, honestly. The flavour's not bad. We've got the um, Blitz um, M1911 review out for this tomorrow. On top of that, I have got the um, Cra- uh, Steam Crave Mouth to Lung Glass, which I love this. With a little bit of... Uh, sorry, me, me, where have I put it? <coughs> It doesn't matter. We've got a little bit of Vampire Vapes uh, lemon pie in there, which is really, really nice. I've got other little bits of devices, but that's about me done. All the way over to the wonderful Simon. Did we not get told, Salford, at the start of this, you can only do two? Yeah. I did three. I have got three. I've only got two now. Have you? Yeah. You moved them across. <clears throat> no. Um, I, 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 I'm really boring because I had this last week. No comment. One, but it's the same one. Shut up. Um, and <clears throat> the Pyro Three, I V Three. I honestly, I haven't put it down. I've, I've, I've got a different colour onto this, and I've just been non-stop on both of those over the last two weeks and now week and a half. And I just, honestly, I love them. Absolutely love them to bits. The flavour, just everything about it. It's on top of the top side, so I can squonk into it. It's just a brilliant. RDT, hard, 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 hard. That was easy for me to say. RDTA. Did you, did you Apps. use that? Did you use that coming over into the nice part of the world and yeah. getting back home? Yeah. I did. I, I, and, I, I, and it didn't fail on you. No, I was a bit. I was a bit worried. I'd still have it when I came back again, but. No. I'm surprised you still got your days. <laughs> yeah. But no, honestly, and and it pains me to say it because I, I there's no love lost between me and Vandy Vape because of what they've done, but I just love it. Absolutely love it to bits. <laughs> Um, and I am still on, again, boring, I know, still on the uh, Vinci, except in the Vinci this week I have still Elements, but I've got Elements, Key Lime, Cookie. However, I've been really, really, really disappointed with the Vinci this week. Sorry, Salford, after you've just got yours. No, no, go, no, go ahead. Go ahead. Um, no problem. I want to know about it. I was sat Saturday night, and this Vinci here just all of a sudden started also far and I've got a video of it, I can send it over across to you because yeah. um, I'd, I'd say go get, get in touch with where I got it from um, but it just literally put the pod on top and it just started auto firing, took, took the pod out of it, put the pod back in, started auto firing again not touching it, not doing anything with it and it's also, I'm finding it's it's getting really bubbly and leaky and stuff pissing out the side of it and it's so just... auto firing? Yeah yeah, I'll I'll dig the video out for you, Ed, and I'll send it across and see if you can uh, see and chat. For I'll send it on Messenger. I think as vapors, I think that's one of the biggest things that you've got to worry about. You sat down there, you might have left your device. It's like obviously I've got a desk full of stuff. So if you leave a device at the side, and then all mm-hmm. of a sudden it starts auto firing, I had that with the um, Enovap, which was really bad. This right. I'm just I am just so pleased that. I'd, I'd, I'd quit. It, it actually done it three times, but I'm just so pleased that I uh, I, I caught it when I did, because it was just scary. 
So, oh, so no, why you just obviously you've left me a little bit late on it myself. Uh, will you do me a favour and just give a bit of a shout out to the people who are in chat? Good grief, there's tons. Um, yeah. I'll tell you what, we'll do it in two shifts. I'll do some Salford, you can do some. Um, Bobster, see. Bobster, yeah, true. Uh, Bob, actually, just before, no, and no, I'll do this after. Uh, uh, Bobster, Gailey Bops, good evening, Gailey Bops, Bobster, Red Prep Net, who is the kind gentleman that uh, sent us the 20 knocks. Um, oh, God, Andy Summerfield, good evening, Andy. Uh, missed you at um, obviously Expo because I wasn't there. Jules Mama Vapes, Village, another one that I missed at uh, Expo. The Vapory, Lee the Geordie Vapor, uh, Chris Doyle, um, Shane Gibson, Lee the Geordie Vapor again. I've said Benny Vapes, not sure who Benny Vapes is. Um, who else have we got? Here, uh, yeah, it for Justin Hillsden. Uh, Ebby Vapes, right, I'll let you pick up and carry on if you want to. Uh, what's that, Red Pepper, is it something? Or Red Prep? Uh, we've got guys on with Village, we've had uh, UK Andy, uh, Tetley Man, Haddy, uh, I'm running down the day now as fast as I can, uh, Dion, Justin, Ian Morgan, Reverend, and I can't see anybody else. Lady Dark Sky. She's wonderful. One of my friends, that. Uh, All the way from the US. Sorry, I've lost chat now because I, I got Benny Vapes as, uh, what do you call it? I, I keep on seeing this Benny Vapes, so oh, I've got no seen. idea who it is. <clears throat> uh, ABC, Kieran, of course. Andy Summerfield has just been giving me a lot of crap, so I'm ignoring him. Um, Big shout out to Kieran as well. He's um, just sat um, at about a hundred thousand views. Yeah, and uh, and my friend Danny Big D Vapes is here as well. He will be coming on the show as well, won't he? Yeah, not next week. Week after. In uh, we've got next week we've next got week. the wonderful um, King's James Vape. Garbage. King's custard. Call oh, King. King's creams. King's custard. Uh, Ebby, uh, I'm still running down this time. You didn't go very far, did you? Have you, you said, got the nice uh, guys in, or one of them? Flat cap, have you said a load of flap yet? Yeah, I said yeah. a lot again. Sorry, cat flap, cat flap. Cat flap, cat flap yeah. The, the wonderful cat flap. Oh, we had such a good giggle. Right, I don't think we've missed anybody now. I think I'm near bottom. Deadly Sinner's 88 saying he's... Uh, oh, Deadly. Oh, sorry, Sinner. <laughs> I think that's it, guys. I think we've gone through most of them. We can only do what we can do. So I'm popping chat back out. What I was going to say before before I was going to go into chat, I need to clarify this, and everybody in chat has to listen to what I'm going to say. I do not dislike Salford. <laughs> I don't hate Salford. I love Salford to bits. Anything that I say to Salford is banter. So you can yeah. stop complaining to Aiden that I'm horrible yeah. with him. I don't. Yeah. I'm not. I'm not horrible with him, really. We're, we're very good friends. I mean, only friends can get away with what we say to each other. You might think that we're actually being nasty to each other, but to us, it's just a big joke. Yeah. That's really nice. You've actually uh, um, clarified that because sometimes I do. I don't. I get messages. People think that you two are actually doing this on purpose, and it, you like having a go. Well, at we each are. Other, we not. are doing it on purpose because we do it at each other all the time. We're doing it on purpose. But it's banter. We're not doing it nastily like people think we're doing it. Just because no, he's a, a bit of a get. I know. I mean, I'm on the in between, but it's really nice you've clarified that. So, please, people, honestly, they're having a good giggle. That's all it is. <laughs> it's not all meant. <laughs> so, Simon, which way do you want to run this? Should we talk a bit about Benny, or do you want to? Should we go through about the news bits? Or no, uh, let's do the, let's do the news. What time are we now? Twenty 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 two. Because uh, we we said we want to be finished bang on nine o'clock, don't we? Yep. Because, um, ladies and gentlemen, you have got the show, uh, the Scottish yeah. reviews. You've got um, yep. Gailey Bops, the bitches, and you've got Vic, and you've also Chris from Empire. They'll be straight away on after us. Make sure you go out there and check them. Yep. So, I was looking through the news today, and I am sure, like me, and, and this is nothing against advocacy, so I'll get that straight before I say it, but I'm sure everybody has 
done the America thing to death, and everybody wants to talk about something a little bit different. The biggest, the big, the one big issue when I was looking through the news, and the thing that really struck me with this when I was going through the news, is that nearly all the British newspapers are talking about the American vape ban, the THC things, you know, the vape uh, lung disease in in America and everything else, and all that feels to me that it's doing is it's just promoting this issue to all the people. Um, that that and and a lot of the newspapers, some of them are giving the good news and saying it is THC. Others are are giving just bad news all the time. Vaping's bad. Don't vape. You know all these illnesses. So for me, when I was reading through that, I was just thinking that all it's doing is it's just promoting the bad message instead of trying to promote the good message. So I was going to pick an American story. I had two, but I've decided to go for the more light-hearted one. So a bit more of a it's not not so much light-hearted, but it's it's a story that I I really well yeah, but it's a story that I like. Um, so it was. It was actually, and in a way, it's a bit of a it's a bit of a promo. But I just absolutely love the concept of this, uh, and it was um, through totally wicked uh, on there. Two seconds, I'll be back. Keep going. No, I'm waiting for you. I can't. I can't do it when you're not there. We can't do it when you're not there. I don't. I don't like being on. I don't like being on my own. Oh, thanks a lot. <laughs> Charming, isn't it? Do my news story, and he sods off. So this story was by Totally Wicked, and it's it, it called it's called oh, I'd say it's two pints of lager and a, a free bite e cig. And the concept for me for this is just absolutely brilliant. Uh, whether you like Totally Wicked or don't like Totally Wicked or see it as promo or whatever, I just think it's a really good good thing to do. Um, the Totally Wicked challenge is well underway, and 500 pubs throughout the UK are now also involved. Um, totally Wicked, we thought the better way to help smokers ditch the habit than down the boozer, where they're about to head outside into the cold into the cold to light up. As much as we would like to go into each and every pub in the UK to talk to smokers, that would be a bit of a stretch. We had an obscene amount of beer mats produced and distributed to 500 pub locations, the majority of which are in very close proximity to a Totally Wicked store. These just aren't beer mats, they're entitled, oh, sorry, they entitled smokers to a free buy e cig. Uh, we're just a matter of days into the campaign, and the uptake has been incredible. Hundreds of smokers have already rushed to their totally wicked store to claim what they thought was too good to be true. Um, blah, 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 blah. And then they've got changing the lives of Burnley smokers. In fewer than 36 hours, the friendly staff at Total Wicked Burnley have received 47 redemptions of bike E6, all from smokers looking to keep the habit. Store manager Amanda and the rest of the team have been in days with Bermuda smokers asking, what's the catch? So it, it just, I, I won't go into loads of it because it's obviously a big up for, for Totally Wicked, but I just think that idea... Of, yeah. of of going out and actually finding a way, which is a really good way to do it, into pubs to promote e-cigarettes to uh, smokers and try and get them to move across. It just It's like you've got a captive market, you're doing something good, all right, they're giving something away, it's promotion for their business without without a shadow of a doubt. Oh, yeah. But it's it's actually something that's doing some good, and it's promoting a good message out to um, to smokers in in an environment where there's lots of people talking, lots of people get together and discuss it. I just think it's a brilliant, brilliant idea. Yeah, it's, uh, he, he did put it on the LinkedIn well before they, they started doing it uh, to let people know that's that that's what they was was gonna do. Um, but they also come out pretty quick as well against the American uh, cap. I don't know if you noticed that as well while you was on They pulled out of America though, didn't they? Yeah, just, well, they, they just pulled they, straight. As soon as they said they were going to do yeah, whatever it is, like RTBD, they just pulled straight out. They yeah. didn't even hang around, they didn't support anything. They just shut all the shops, shut down, and just said, right, we're leaving. Yeah. You think they yeah. just, you know, because they're quite big in America, aren't they? You know, so you think they just stopped and supported it. Because what's that, two years ago? Yeah. You know. And they didn't. That's what gets me with Totally Wicked. Plus, they're not the best of things, are they? Well, they, 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 had, they had got a lot of stick, didn't they, in the States, um, beforehand. Um, a lot of things put on them and what have you. And I think it all come down to what they was paying out already, and it wasn't even regulated over there. So I think that was one of the reasons they pulled out of there. But it, it, you've got to remember, Totally Wicked's been in this game a long time. And it was the first real big place that it was about. Well, Totally yeah, Wicked is actually connected to UK vape brands, which is a lot of yeah. um, the stuff that comes in from uh, Joytech, um, Wismec, E-Leaf. E-Leaf, yeah. Well, on, uh, well, on, it was on eBay at first, wasn't it? That's where they used to sell. On eBay. Well, on the it, we had a small place in Burnley when they first started off as well. Yeah. Uh, and they, they used to supply stuff to market-style uh, traders. Back in about 2008, 
I will take me out of it. It's a good idea. Do you know mm. what I mean? Don't get me wrong to get people off, but I just think totally wicked doing for it themselves, aren't they? You know. Well, no, but this, this is. I mean, any. Yeah, but any any business is in it for themselves, aren't yeah. they? It doesn't it doesn't matter what you do. They're out, they're out there to to make money. And it's like I said, I think the thing for me is totally wicked feel to me like the they're like the curries of vape shops, aren't they? They're like just yeah. you know, sort of sell it quick, cheap. Well, not necessarily cheap, but you know what I mean. It's it's just like a a, a bit like sort of box shifters in a way. There's 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 no real passion do, behind do, it. Do you more. think that, that most of actually bricks and mortar stores are like that? We you go down to the bottom bottom of my street where there's a there's a vape store. They didn't want anybody who had any knowledge about vaping. As a as a somebody who's selling stuff, they, what they wanted was is somebody who's like green and let them tell them what to sell. Because if not, yeah, the certain items they're going to get in there is just going to stay on the fucking stand. It's, yeah. not, it's not like they're going to be able to sell. Somebody comes in for a, they just come off at Siggy's. You think I'll tell you what I'll sell them. I'll sell them a Nautilus two and a Cool Fire four. They want the big stuff going off the shelves. No, mm-hmm. I went to I'd, like I said to you, I'm a, I'm a gas engineer. We do domestic as well. We've got a domestic contracts. I went in. There's this little old lady. And she's got like a smock <coughs> thing with a TF8 saying, Oh, I don't like that. Don't like that vaping lark. And I'm like, Well, where'd you it's get that? I bought, it, I bought it down the road at shop down the road. I'm like, Well, that's why I'll never help you. Do you know what I mean? Hmm. And it, hmm. well, that was the same thing. They're not in it. They were just out to sell a, you know, an 80 quid bit of kit like. Uh, just what we just want to talk just before we carry on. Um, we need to get Benny Vapes at least over 50. Um, subscribers, uh, we've got the Vatio, the Trio Nano we're going to give away, and we've also got the Trans Max kit, we've also got um, 100 ml of juice as well, um, all thing you want to do is you've got to pay the postage, I'm sure Mr. Coiler will lob a coily in there as well, yeah, um, awesome so yeah. please, yeah, yeah. Let's, let's go over there and subscribe to him, um, he's Thank a lovely you. bloke. I will yeah, paste course. again in there. That, yeah, that's his link. Go over there and subscribe to him. We will be doing a giveaway. Like I said, the trans kit, which is a really nice kit. We've got the uh, Trio Nano kit. Uh, or Trio. 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 And then we've got 100 ml of juice as well. All for you lot. Get over there and make him over the 50. Please go yeah. and do it. Right, sorry, carry on. <laughs> So, <clears throat> so it's it's like I said for me the 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 it, it wasn't about it. I suppose it was about totally wicked, but it's the fact that somebody's just got a bit of. I I, I just wanted to see something upbeat, something positive about vaping instead of all the negative stuff. Like I said, that's going on at the minute, and to me that just felt like a really good story. Somebody's doing something positive. Somebody's spreading a positive message instead of. And it's like I said, just. I absolutely get all the, the other stuff that's going on, and I get that lots of people talk about it, and that's the right thing to do. But I think if if we can talk about something that's that's the positive side of open, which I really, well, you just blown a kiss at me then. You no, know, my wonderful wife. As well, she just turned up in a towel as well, which is even better. <laughs> <laughs> the trouble is, you're married. You don't get to say anything like that anymore now. It's all so memories. Thank you. So I, I just really like the positive, and, and it's like I said. I think everybody, certainly in this country, needs at the minute needs happy. And, and I know you know my, well, a lot of people tell me you need to be realistic, but I think well, we need as many happy, upbeat, positive stories that we can get at the minute. Keep things, you know. What, what are we getting Benny up to? Fifty. I'm over to there. Over fifty. Well, we want well, him at well, least over fifty. <laughs> He's past it now, isn't it? We want him up to 60 then. Yeah, hey, you're Thank past you it, so. I tell you, if we could hit him to 100 subscribers this tonight, it'd be, be absolutely yeah. fantastic. Uh, yeah. And I'm sure, um, with big love to uh, Jules Mama Vapes. I tell you what, lads, we've, we've sat there and we aren't Jules Mama's Vapes on this, this show. And I don't know why we haven't. So uh, we need to be getting Jules Mama Vapes on the show. Thank you so much for, for lobbing it out there for us as well, sweetheart. I'm doing one of yours, a hard on. Um, <laughs> Uh, you have to look also, up into my dick up. Did your last just walk past? Is that what it was? Hey, well, yeah. Did, did, did I freeze? Yeah. Uh, also, yeah. um, I'm, I'm sure Gailey Box might might push it a little bit on the show after us as well. Let's get him over 100 if we can do. But like Go I said, on. we have got we've got two lovely starter kits there. Plus that one takes um, Nautilus coils, um, and then we've got 100 ml of juice as well. The only thing you want to do is you've got to pay the postage. That's all you want to do. Um, can, we get, can we get Jules on instead of Salford? Do that. Oh, that's a bit nasty. I'm from Oldham. Where's he get that from? Or, or Salford. You could you could put a wig on, couldn't you? Do you want to get it? To us. Yeah. I'm, I'm a Yorkshireman. Thank you very much. He's a Yorkshireman. Right. You can tell as well. 
Uh, you big shout out to Hip Hop Juice. Absolutely nice to see your brother in. Um, Forty-five pound postage flat cap. That's just yours and my beer fund for uh, next expo, bro. We didn't answer the question that we got for the twenty knocks. Which was? Which was? What's your favourite RDA and mech for twenty nineteen? Well, I, I'm not really good on mechs, so I'm not a mech man either. To be fair, I'm a bit well, like you, Adrian. I keep thinking it's a bomb. My RDA, it's a bomb. My RDA would go to the Alexander. Uh, yeah, my RDA is the Alexander as well, without yeah, a shadow of a doubt. From Uddersfield. From Uddersfield. Ah, I'll add this from Uddersfield. Um, Mex, I'm not really. If you want to get Mex, go down to me, brother. But saying that, though, Mark now is not really a Mech. He's, he's on him. He's on tanks and um, regulated. Yeah, well, it's, it's so expensive getting Mechs, isn't it? I haven't bought one this year. I I still use to this day my dreamer, Times Weight Dreamer. I just still use the copper one, it's still sat here on my desk. He's a clean, but it's still there. Well didn't standing out the kit was it the keen this year? Yeah, the yeah. keen which is obviously from Stan from uh, Tenacious D mm. or oh, Tenacious Vapes. Absolutely fantastic bloke as well. He's really nice. I've met him quite a number of times and I had a really good beer with him. Um the thing I like about the Keen is the beauty rings that they put on that. So obviously, if you've got a twenty-eight or twenty-four, twenty-six, whatever, it'll fit on top. Just the other thing, the other one that I like. None of these are two thousand and nineteen. I think uh, I think I bought my oh god, I can't remember the name. Uh, Gail. Uh, oh, it's Gail or Zan, Kenny's Kenny's mate, Claymore. Claymore. Love the Claymore. Yeah. yeah. So you see, I like proper copper. Brass mechs. I don't. I'm not. I saw somebody sent me a photo of one at Expo. I think. I think it was at Expo, and it looked like a sodding tennis ball. It had got some coating on it. Really nice. That's really nice. Obviously, people. If if you might have a, a few of you sat down there thinking, do you know what? I quite fancy a mech. As long as you get the build right, and you've got no nicks in your batteries and stuff like that, and you you really do try then it's a little bit different than having a regulated sort of stuff. You've got to make sure you're on the ball. Don't yeah. upside down your batteries. Make sure your batteries have got... If you're into that sort of stuff and you can build and you get your ohms low, then they are really nice, hard-hitting mods. So I did all that and then still ended up pooping myself, thinking I'm going to blow myself up. So I, 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 just, I, I love mechs. I just don't use them as often enough. I'm, I'm not... I can't, I, I'm... I'm Lazy because I can't be asked to keep dripping all the time. That's my biggest problem. Yeah, <laughs> well, I'm, I'm saying with you, dripping's all right if you sat at home and you're watching telly and right. you've got something like a, a custard or you've got a fruit, you know, something that you really like. Then yeah, if you're working all the time, isn't it? You can't do it. No, but I, I do like where it. Gonna, well. Number one, where are you going to put it? Yeah, yeah. You tip it upside well. down. It's dripping. Mm. If you do battery, you know, if you're hitting it. Few things and you change your battery again. Yeah, but there's just honestly, there's just there's something about it. There's something about having just having that. Mech change your just, I don't time. know. Yeah, but it just I don't know. I, I can't I can't describe it. Zan just asked me about the enforcer. Uh, Zan, I did exactly the same thing. I, I bought an enforcer off Zan. Oh, I can't remember how long ago it was. Not not that long ago. But as soon as I got the claymore off Kenny, that was it. I, I got rid of the enforcer straight after. So purge. The, you saw about the top side there, uh, old Bill Richards, always nice to see you, brother. The new light's really nice. Really do like that, like yeah. I showed last week. Just pull it, pull it off, it, obviously you've got your, where, where your screw goes through to make it, and then you just stick a bit of plastic on that side and you've got a, a 21700 actual mod, right, which I quite like, I think the idea is good. Is it plastic, Adam? Yes, yeah, plastic, on that side. No. Um Old Stevie was saying that he thinks if you dropped it, it'd um, dilly gaff porter. Make sure you go over and it where's your stand? It's here somewhere. I've got mine. Never, uh, never, never normally nice far. Oh, oh, there we go. It's there. Make sure you go over to dilly gaff porter stands on Facebook. Go and get one. These are absolutely fantastic to build on. They're really good. Um, he was saying that he thought that once you dropped it, it's going to break. I can maybe see what he's saying. You know, with the plastic bit, it might yeah. crack. Um, Depends on how much flexibility is in the plastic, doesn't it, really? Yeah. I've, uh, I've, 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 near enough, the reviews are going to be out in the next three or four days, isn't it? 
Well, after you've done the review, like throw it on floor and let's see how long it lasts. <laughs> yeah. I don't think you could stand on it. <laughs> no, no. Is it? It's not even out yet, though, is it? It came out on uh, when we were at Expo. I, I thought it wasn't releasing it because I was watching <clears> um, TVC on Sunday show that they do, and he hadn't done his he hadn't done his release of it yet. Yeah, it's not released in America, but it was released actually yeah, yeah. at the Expo um, the, the last oh, no, so, weekend we so, were there. Because I've got a bit of a chat with him, it's on my blog when I've got that to come up anyway. Nice bloke as well, Brian. Brian's a really nice bloke. Mm, it is. Obviously, you speak a lot more to these people, don't you, with the uh, the coily, don't you, Simon? Uh, it, well, yeah. Yeah, I speak to... I probably don't speak to them as much as I used to do now, but I usually go and see whoever I can see when I'm at Expo and, and have an odd chat online sometimes, but that's uh, that's about it. The SQ looks really good as well, yeah, the top side. The, the yeah. SQ... Um, uh, who was it? Rick, Ricky from uh, Vape Don't Smoke. He was there, and he bought that. I really like the look of that. Nice, nice bit of kit. It looks really good. I've got to show it off. So if you want to see it, it's on the vlog when I put that up for Expo. It's on the vlog. Make sure you check it out. Again, people, make sure you go and go over to his channel and subscribe. Yeah. We've got a giveaway. Oh, yeah. Simon, you're going to have to sort this giveaway shit out. How? Uh, do I have to come up with a question? Uh, come up with a question. We've, we, like I said, we've got the uh, trans kit. We've also got the, this is all box, brand new. We've got the Vaptio Nano Kit, and we've got 100 mil of juice. Please go over, you have to subscribe to uh, Benny Vapes. I don't know, are you checking what he's on? Um, I, I am, yeah, I'm, I'm on the Social Blade. He's, he's, on 50, he's on 57 at the moment. Come yeah. on, people, keep pushing it across, keep yeah. pushing over there, go and get him up higher. It's always nice to support another northerner. Well, what we're we talking about, then? let's talk a little about you, Benny. I know you've been around a little bit, my mate. Um, I know you have a lot to do with Les as well from the Juice Cabin. Yeah, it's only because I've been in his shop, right? Yeah, he's a nice bloke as well. He is, yeah, very nice. Yeah, uh, nice. he did the Yo 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 Juice. Yeah, yeah. Uh, which yeah. is the Tic Tac stuff going down there. You can get that from, um, from the Juice Cabin. How did you first start reviewing? Just one minute. Yeah. Where, where is mine and Simon's baked beans? Yeah, I was, you know, I was just thinking that earlier you know, on. Yours is still in the bucket. As he just, just reminded me. Mm. I bought mine. Thanks. <laughs> Your baked beans are actually up there. They are still there. I need to send them out. <laughs> How did you get into it? Basically, I've well, I've been vaping for on and off for a while, for about six years. And uh, I've, I, I did a little review of my sub tank, I had sub tap mini. And then that were, and I never bothered. Then after that, I never, never did anything. And then I got the everybody were going on about the Aspire. What's that one? What slanted Sprite? Saying yeah. that was really good. So I bought one of them. It's not that that sort of first yeah, yeah. one. And everybody was saying it was really good. So I thought, yeah, I'll do a review on it. So I did that one. And then I got the Aspire AIO, and that were even worse. So. I thought I'd bang up, and that's how I got started, really, doing them. Um, and it would cost, from January to now, I've lost two and a half stone, so I got a bit of confidence up as well. So right. I thought I'd give it a go and see what's what. So, yeah. You are smashing it. I love your reviews. You've, you've moved from upstairs down to downstairs, haven't I you? have, yeah. I'm down here now. Yeah, a little bit bigger. But I have my white We've got up, some photographs me. up as well now. Yeah, I have some little... Uh, one away from six there. Yeah. So I've got Deadpool up there and Venom there. Oh, yeah. So how have you actually found this of the um, reviewing scene? Is it is it what you thought it was? or? Because I, 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 I don't really... Because usually, I, like I say, tonight I were home late and I don't usually catch live shows, so it's all replays that I watch. So I'm not in chat, you know, so I don't really know a great deal of people. You know, when I make yourself down at Expo and uh, Solo Mark and uh, Flat Cap, Hood Puffs, I then go up to tell, talk to everybody in little, uh, what is it, reviewers part, because we were all sat down in that little sofa and I felt a bit, I'm a bit social anxious. So I sort of stopped on outside where Flat Cap and Hood Puffs and that one, nice guys, a little bit vapey. But no, it's just, everybody's been nice to me anyway. No one's been 
Red Prep, yeah. Big yeah. Love Bait. Uh, uh, we're not like that, honestly. Obviously, I was welcomed here in, into the reviewer scene really well because obviously my brother's my brother did it. Uh, but no, obviously next year you'll be able to come down and sit with the the rest of the reviewers. Um, yeah, yeah. They're all fantastically lovely. You, you're going to get on well with everybody. Well, they'll see if I ever, like I said, the ones I talked to, everyone were talking to me. It was just, it was first expo, I know, a bit like that. You've got the, the the wonderful guys from the nice guy, a little bit vapey, Marcus, and that. They're absolutely fantastic people as well. Now, I want to talk, talk to them. We're all, all opening. Yeah. yeah. Does that make sense? It? Opening. Opening? Opening. Big opening. opening. <laughs> big, big opening for a big lad. <laughs> you need it, mate. You need it. Um, Simon, when you first sort of like turned up to your first expo, it was a little bit daunting for you, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Because you, you see all these people that you see on uh, live streams and reviews and things like that. And it was, uh, it, it just sort of blew me away. I think um, it was the first one. Yeah, it was, I think it was the no, it was, yeah, it was the October one. I've only been to two, so it was October, I went to October's Expo last year and May's this year. Um, but I think I, I got to talk, talk to it, it. It it was sort of I was a bit um, what's the word? You know, when you meet sort of celebrities, for me it was just like oh, I, I can't do this. The, the, Mike Vapes, I went to see Mike Vapes, went talked to Mike Vapes, but talked to Bogan, talked to Brian TVC. Um, and it You're was just overwhelmed. starstruck, yeah. I think that was that was the word. So uh, it was just and, and meeting. No, yeah. no, I won't bother about him. But you know, yourself, uh, Mark, TVP, uh, Vic, uh, Devil Dean wasn't at the first one that he went to, but it was the one that I went to uh, in May. Well, it was when we just went to all... the uh, award ceremony where you won. Oh yeah, yeah. That's that's a, that's a moment I'll never ever, never ever forget. Absolutely loved it. And then he obviously got Jules, and uh, Jules just looked after everybody. I don't think Gailey was the first one that I went to. No, Gailey, so, Gailey missed a couple. Hmm, oh, she so, came to the last uh, one, but late on. Yeah, but it was just the the whole atmosphere was just brilliant, and everybody, all the reviewers in that in that um, area were just brilliant. It was, honestly, it was just fantastic. And, and my wife's been with me both times. She absolutely loved it as well, because she just she, everybody's just made to feel welcome. You just made to feel fit, and just love every one of them, everyone. So yeah, it's, uh, it's it, obviously you don't come Salford obviously with your health, ill health and stuff like. That. It must be really hard. You sat down there, and you don't. I'm an antisocial get though, aren't I? No, I, th- I think you'd love yeah. it if if you could just get yeah. you there, and yeah. we'd all look after you. It's it's difficult, and it. Um, for me, because everybody sees me on here and they see me on the reviews, and I look, I look all right. But the likes of Bob knows exactly how I am when I'm walking and stuff like that. You know, everything is, everything I do is, uh, it's a major task. If if I'm getting a shower, it's a major task. It has to be planned, uh, and that's that's the difficulty in it all. You know, and it it, it does. Uh, it does make things difficult for me because I'm not getting out there to meet vendors or you know yeah. Yeah. manufacturers and stuff. Um, so it, it does work against me, but it's just one of them things that it can't be helped, can it? Yeah, you know? yeah. Um, helped, it? Just a little bit of that as well, too, Benny. How did you find that? You, obviously, you got some cards made up, and you must be obviously starting off. I know exactly how it how, how it works. How did you find it? Do you feel it really intimidating or? Yeah. It was a bit hard on on Saturday because I only went down for a day on Saturday dinner, um, so it was a little bit because it was busy. It was hard to get over and you know talk to people and say, "Oh, there's my card," and you know I did give a couple out, but not as I, I was too busy sort of in order of everything to be honest with you. So I didn't even I hardly tried any jokes. I didn't I just looked round and then they were gone and I'm coming back home, you know so. Yeah, the whole weekend does go really quick. Um, obviously, I've been. Hell of a number of them exposed, and you sort of chill out after a while. Um, it is, it is overwhelming. Yeah, there's so much to see when you go in. I thought it'd be a little bit smaller, but no, they were just just off everywhere, wasn't it? You know, so by the time you walked out red carpet right down to where the stage was and shot off arm there, that were nearly all my day gone. Mm. And, so, so I'll tell you what it what it what it's like. That it's just like a real community. So it's you know like when I've been at the premiere in both times, 
and just everybody that's at the premiere, not just the reviewers, but everybody. So I think there was uh, Liz there, and there's just loads of people. We were sat talking to a couple. Was it last expo? The, the two blokes who you were talking. To? I'll never oh, forget no. that, that, that. Yeah, just hilarious. But everybody is just. It's it's like like I said. It's just like a, a whole community of people, and everybody just. Well, the majority of people just get on, and everybody talks to everybody else, and there's no, I don't know, it's just such a nice atmosphere. It really, really is. <laughs> you, you're on, pretty, guys, you're pretty lucky with it, because you, you, these people that you've known for years and years, you, you might not see them for six months, but then you go back, it's just like your family, and it, you're like you've only been speaking to them the day before. It's because you know each other that well. Yeah. It's, you just fit back in together like a, like a glove. Uh, just as well, uh, just well, more... spamming out ben, Benny's uh, page. Yeah. Please do a giveaway for that as well. Make sure you go over there and subscribe. Sorry. Yeah, so we want that. one more to get him to 60 at least. Come on, guys. You've got to be one of you out there that hasn't subscribed to him. But the, the the other thing, sorry, yeah, the other the other thing is that it's not just the big show. So it's not just the expos. I went to uh, what was the one near you Aiden, last year. The, uh, the Doncaster one. It was the yeah, uh, yeah whatever it was called. Yeah, I forgot. Yeah, cool. well, it was collective. Vet collective, yeah. yeah, and it was only a little thing. There was, there was what maybe 30, 30 stands there, and there was even less when I think when I got there on the Sunday slink, some of them were packed up and gone. Sixty-two. But, Thank you. But again, it was just uh, Bill. Um, uh, I, I stood talking to Bill for the ages at one of the stands, and it was just it's like I said again, this whole community thing, and um, the guy Peter from uh, Homemade Coils, he, he had Coily on his stand, and and it's honestly it's like I said, everybody just sort of talking together, working together, just talking. That each, I just love it. I absolutely love that community spirit. And as like I said, I don't think you need to go to an expo to, to have all that. I think you get all that wherever you go. It's a shame really? that one went, to be honest with you, because I went to the first one. It was it a month or two, but it was small. Obviously, <coughs> I walked around it in about an hour. Hmm. You know, but... It was, yeah, so it was a lovely, lovely day, though. It was absolutely, the, the weather were really good. We got to still... each other, meet each other as well. It was really good. Yeah, the, the photo of me, you, and Mark. <laughs> yeah. still, I've still got I'd that. Say Mark's somewhere. not the biggest bloke in the world. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Mark. 64 with that. <clears throat> Again, ladies and gentlemen, if you're looking at this on the replay, please go over there. I know you can't win the, the giveaway. Uh, Simon, can you come up with your question, dude? Yeah, I'm not going to do a numbers one. It's going to be a straightforward guess, and I might have to give a clue. But I think I've mentioned this on the show so at some point in the past. I have a hobby, aside from vaping and a normal day job, I have a hobby. Um, so it's, it's who can guess what that hobby is. Is it the one that, that has a gimp mask with it? No. Oh, but right. if, if, if you're very close, you might be able to see some stuff behind me that indicates what it is. I know what it is, because we've you actually do. got quite the same. We didn't know this, but we've actually got quite the yeah. um, same thing. Not trains, flat cap, no. <coughs> <coughs> it's something that I would do with other people. Oh, well, this is. It might be do with the gym master. master. <laughs> <laughs> so whips and chains. Uh, big shout out to Jules Mama Vapes. She, uh, I want to say something about her. She was sat down there she, uh, at the expo, and there was um, obviously we were all connected to Vape Tube. She sat down there and she made sure everybody from whether you're a small reviewer or whether you're a big reviewer to get the stuff that was there. She went to tits <laughs> off for other people's stands as well. She absolute wonderful lady um, and thank you very much for all you do for us. And again to uh, Gailey Bops and all the people over there, Liz and all them, we were so looked after at Expo. We, we've got these set of ladies who are part of vaping. Um, even M, down to M, oh, um, we, we are so looked after um, by the ladies, so uh, it is a male in you know like a lot of it's to do with males, isn't it? Vaping, but we have got them that like the bitches. Um, we've we've got the the people just look after us really well. So thank you very much to all of you who mother us, which we all need that as an older man especially. So looked after, and thank you very much for all you do for us. I'm loving some of these answers. Morris dancing from Cat Flap. No. Churning butter. <laughs> Churning butter. <laughs> now, Bill, the the theatre in the World War. No, I don't do the World War Two reenactment, but the theatre stuff isn't isn't a hobby. It's a, it's a, it, I enjoy doing it, but it's a, it's more of a sort of part time job that I don't. So I'll, 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 I think I'm right. Obviously, I don't, I don't know whether he's he's thinking on the same way as him, but I will go for um, something to help you. Um, yeah. I'm trying to think of one of them. That's not too obvious. 
Um, I'm trying to think of one as well. I, I am, yeah. I'm, I'm thinking of him from Bradford. I'll put it on... Um, Dynamo! Uh, just, that, just fucking hell. That, that, that just not obvious. That? <laughs> Dynamo! You're not really here. So we're waiting for that chat to come up. Dynamo! Yeah. Big D vapes. Big D vapes <laughs> from Holmesford. You have won this, bro. Uh, make sure you just, uh, you know my uh, email address. So on the <laughs> no reviews. <laughs> fucking Carl, I might as well have said fucking Paul Daniels, might I? Yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking no, I was, I was, I was, I was trying to be, I was trying to be. <laughs> so, yeah, so, so what sort of magician? <laughs> what, what, what would you have said? Man, well, as, I don't know. There's lots of Darren Brown. That I put <laughs> Darren Brown, yeah. There's Darren in it. <laughs> Darren Brown or whatever he's called. Some things I could have, uh, I could have picked off the shelves you to give it to you. All you do is just pay for the. Uh, I think it's four pounds something um, for the watch of God. You send it to me PayPal, and I will get that sent out to you this week. You, you do know Danny won mine on Friday night, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> and was you was was yours a magician as well? No, 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 no. But he made me. He made the uh, brand new EQ and the spare pod disappear from me. <laughs> so Simon, next week uh, we're expecting. We've uh, obviously got um, the wonderful from Kings. Um, James Garbridge. Has he as yet sent you? He said it was coming on. Bear with, no, but has he sent you yet? No, not yet. Shall I share it? I probably will. I'll, I'll give it a little tweak. The There's that rock. one. Oh, <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm trying not to show people what it is. And well, he's already put it on his site and stuff. On his site. Has he? Oh, all right then. Well, it wasn't that. It was just being a bit more. But, yeah, that's what you do, isn't it? To get people to watch, you give them a. Well, no. See what we're going to get to a... watch is next week. You are going to do a trick oh. live. Yeah, but I don't know. Well, is he going to disappear? I mean, you <laughs> don't want him to do that, do we? No, he's going to turn I'll, I'll tell you what. I'm going to do. Oh a trick. no, you're already a frog, bro. I'm going to do a trick as well. Um, I like it. Not a lot, but you might like it. You might like it, but not a lot. <laughs> I will do. I'll, I'll do a trick that all everybody on there will be able to do. I will do a trick next week. It's the tricky one. Is finding one that you can do on camera. Yeah, I'll be able to do it on camera, and you will all be able to do it. And I'll tell you what, you will. And you've got to do one as well. Right, I have to dig through and find something. It's nothing to do with disappearing a beer can either. No, no, <clears throat> don't, don't, don't go there. I was going to say Salford <laughs> can do that anyway. Can I? I We've got five minutes left. We are going to finish eight. nice and early because please get over to. I'm not quite sure what channel it is. I'm sure somebody will be able to put it in there. You've got Vaping with Vic, obviously, a struggling reviewer, needs the subs. Get over to Vic and subscribe to him. You've got Gailey Bops and all the pictures. And you have also got Chris from Empire. Their show is straight away after us at nine o'clock. Please go over and check them out. Benny, it has been absolutely fantastic to have you yeah. on, brother. Been a pleasure. Thank you very much for having me on. And again, people, make sure you go over there and subscribe. So if you're looking on the yeah. um, replay or whatever else, please go over. Um, yeah. Let's try and get him to a hundred. I know he's just over sixty, old, isn't he, bro? See, sixty-four. Come on, somebody in there can make it up to sixty-five. I'm sure. Come on, people, go over there yeah. and subscribe to him. Absolutely what? fantastic, bloke. Another northerner. Oh, uh, use a dozen right. different accounts. Go over and use one of your other accounts. Is another northerner who looks at his actual TV screen instead of the camera? We're it's here. There. We're, here. <laughs> we're here. We're here. No, we're here. No, you're looking we're at the screen. Here. We're here. The camera's here, and I'm here, and I'm trying to see what. <laughs> I don't like that. Look, and I can't see what you're doing. Don't so, think you're <laughs> doing. <laughs> so um, Benny, what have we got coming up on your channel this week? I've got my Vapor Expo vlog. That's not that good, but it's there. Um, yeah, because I like that with selfie stick all over. Um, and I've just done the down low for the Tinker 2. It, uh, yeah, there's, there's issues with this. Look at that. I've only had it three weeks. Oops. Danny's phone yeah. went dodgy. He wants to know how he gets uh, the money across to you, Aiden. Um, all I think we'll do is I'll, I'll just email me. Look on one of my reviews if you'd like to. <laughs> and there's an email address, littlebrovapes at gmail.com. Just send me that over there and I'll send you a PayPal link. Yeah, so that's what's hit, coming up. You just hit 66. Thank you. Hey, well done, people. Thank you for everybody who's subscribing. It's much appreciated, honestly. Oh. 
over to it's gone up again that's good now if you take your top off <laughs> well, we'll see these man boobs. Honestly. Get the man boobs out. Yeah. Get the man boobs out. We, we can all do it. Yeah. <laughs> I've got to get it. Please, now, lass. Um, over to the wonderful Salford. Say your goodbye. Oh, wait there. No, before we do the, the goodbyes, what we need to do is Salford's quote of the week. Here we go, people. Salford's quote, quote, quote of the week. Of the week. <laughs> <laughs> right. Uh, is that your proper voice, Salford? Is that what you normally talk about? <laughs> yeah. It's, it's when they've got the players out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, humanity is acquiring all the rights to technology for all the wrong reasons. I think that's proper right. That's very, right. very, very deep, is that, isn't it? It is, yeah. I'll stop making that bomb in a bit. It <laughs> 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 is rucksack. <laughs> Players are not that. <laughs> Salford, say your goodbyes, bro. Right, guys, we, as I say every week, without you, they're in chat. We don't have a show. Uh, much appreciated that you come over. And the spammers and Jules, for, she's been pumping out all the stuff all night long for us, uh, all our YouTube channels and everything. Guys, thank you very much. Uh, massive thank you to Benny for coming on, of course. Simon, I do love, I don't hate. And uh, yo, 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 big bro there for keeping it all going. Put it back over. That's just Simon, I think. Go off to Simon. To me. What, what him and the point in the right way. What him over there, everything he said. Right <laughs> over there, right over the far side. Uh, now, honestly, everybody in chat, um, I, I've tried to sort of keep a better eye on, on chat, but everybody knows that I'm crap at it. Um, but thank you to everybody who's been watching the show. Thank you to the, the spanners who've been looking after everything and putting all the links out. Thank you very much to uh, Benny Votes. Good to meet you. First time I've met you. Um, thank you very much for, for coming on the show. And I know you said on yeah. Twitter you were bricking it, but I think I you've, uh, you, yeah. you've not you've not shown that all. And the wonderful, wonderful Salford. Yes, I do love Salford to bits. Um, the, there is honestly, absolutely, hand on heart, no malice between me and Salford, whatever. We are, we are really good friends. Uh, and to the wonderful, as Aiden says, brother from another mother, Mr. Aiden. Aiden, little bro vapes. Uh, just love you to bits. So thank you. Love the show. Really enjoyed it. Benny, it's your turn as well to say goodbye, mate. Right. Thank you very much for having me on. Um, it's been great. It's come really quick. Um, it's flown by, but thanks, Salford. It's nice to have met you, Simon. Nice to have met you. Like I say, I've not met you before. It's really nice to meet Phil. Welcome. Aiden, thank you for inviting me on. Everybody who's in chat for subscribing, fantastic. And all the spanners for doing their job, spamming me out. Thank you very much. It's much appreciated. Like I say, I didn't expect it, but yeah, thank you. And yeah, that's it. We will be getting Jules Mama Vapes on the show. And I've just thought here, I've not had her any on the shows. I think we've had her on, she's been on Savs. We've not had her on here. We need to get her on this channel. And I've not thought about this. Jules Mama, I'm going to be sending you a message to get you on this show. Um, big love to you, sweetheart. Thank you for everything you've done for us. Everybody, all the actual uh, Alan, Ryan's Braces, all the actual people who have got that spanner. Thank you very much for looking after us. All the people in chat. Love you absolutely loads. Make sure you go over to the next show, which is with um, Vic, the wonderful bitches, and also Chris, Empire Vape. Get over and watch that show. You're probably already there. Big love to everybody else. We will see you next week. Same bat channel, same bat time. Big love. Yo, yo, yo. Good night. Bye. 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 Don't forget to check out my latest Red. video. Also, don't this forget one. to check out Three Men and a Vape Show live yeah, every Wednesday. Don't and also, if you've enjoyed the video, make sure you subscribe. Yeah, go and ring and that notification yeah, bell. That and we'll catch you later. Especially all the teachers. One of these. You've got to have one of these. We're going to get one for ours as well. Yay. I should have.